Hi, this is Rich from A1 Foundation Crack Repair, here with my friend uh, Peter Marshall from Marshall Insurance. Um, in today's marketplace of real estate, there's a lot of condominiums that are for sale that people are buying. And Peter, could you go over a little bit about condo insurance? Sure, I'd be happy to. So if you're buying a condo or you own one, the very first thing you want to do and that you want your insurance agent to ask you is for a copy of the bylaws so that they can read the insurance section of the bylaws. Every copy of bylaws for each different condo association can be different in regards to what the unit owner is responsible to insure as far as the structure itself or the master policy, the association, and what they're responsible to insure. And I've seen cases where the bylaws state the unit owner is responsible from the studs in and including fixtures uh, such as cabinets and things like that. And I've seen, I've read bylaws where the unit owner is not responsible for any part of the structure whatsoever. They're only responsible for their own personal property. Um, and a good example of that is a customer of mine invited me to speak with the other unit owners in her complex. And a lot of them brought their policies. And I reviewed the insurance section of their bylaws with them. And it was amazing. They brought up their policies to me. One person had 5,000 for unit coverage. Another one had 125,000. So the disparity between what they understood they needed and what they purchased was amazing. And all it takes is an experienced insurance agent to read the insurance section and to know this is what you need and go from there. Peter, and I know you're an experienced well, you can tell Agent. by my hair. Yes, sure. you can. Yes. Thank you very much. And I hope this is informative to buyers of condominiums or current owners of condominiums.